Hey there folks, sorry for starting a couple of minutes late. So you got a bunch of people waiting, which is nice. Usually how it works is when I start the stream, it's like like five people waiting, and then it goes out to zero, and then it goes back up. I never understood why that happens. It's like, <laughs> I say this every time, but it's like people join the stream, and they're like, oh, I thought I was here to see something completely different. But today we're here, this is now for something completely different. We're going to play this game, Escape from Delirium. Um, apparently it's supposed to be similar to Monkey Island 2 in terms of like the, uh, the style, but not funny. <laughs> so I don't know what that means. We'll see. Um, Hey gamers Grotto, how's it going? And, uh, yeah, stay stew and company. I don't know who the company is, but, um, let's get started. Uh, we'll kick this game off. I will say one thing about this game. This is the first game. I've... Hey Jasper, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. This is the first game I've ever seen for DOS where it seems like it's optimized not for Sound Blaster, but for Gravis Ultrasound. Uh, when I tried to run it for Sound Blaster, it was choppy, it didn't work. But under Gus, it works great. So let's kick it off. Let's see what we got here. I am good, Jasper. I hope you're good too. I am good so far, but we'll see how the game is. That really tends to affect my mood. <laughs> if the game is good, I'll be good. If the game is bad, then I'll, I'll be disappointed. Uh, let's see, here we go. Actually, let me do one thing here. I want to make sure I can... Ooh, drop... This is I'm dropping some frames. Let me just close some stuff here. I want to make sure that it's not going to do that. I don't know why that happens sometimes. Give me one sec just to optimize a couple things here. Close a couple things that don't need to have me open. And give me one sec. That I would like to be open if possible. Yeah, encoding overloaded. I understand. Don't worry, I'm fixing it. All right, there we go. Hey, Ryan, how you doing, man? Glad you could join. It's not too late for you today. All right, hopefully it'll stop dropping frames now. Let's let's try the game and see how it goes. And if it's if it's weirding out, we'll, I'll fix it. Oops, delirium, delirium. Here we go. So again, this is Gravis Ultrasound sound emulated under DOS box. It reminds me of full throttle music, actually, in the beginning. Virtual experience. I don't know how I stay so late in coast time. It's, it's a gift. <laughs> it's called waking up late. Escape from delirium. Okay, let's go intro. Now, this music is very, very, very tedious. I, I'll, if you start, if you ask me to turn it down, I will, because it starts to get really annoying. So, so there's some news in 1948: a Friday, an antique corpse is found in the abandoned subway tunnel. What's an antique corpse? The town council ordered a group of specialists to investigate the issue. I guess they mean like an old corpse. So this dude is like going down in a winch in 1948 and the foreman says, everything okay down there? All right. And they got this like mode seven zooming or something. <laughs> then let's go. Yeah, I saw that right. I didn't get a chance to respond to you yet. So there's a, it sounds like there's a mouse squeaking, but I think that's supposed to be the, the winch noise. And then this guy falls. And he's got unconscious, I guess. Hey, what's going on down here? Paul, are you okay? I guess my name is Paul. Stay right there, will you? I'll fetch some help. And now he woke up. What happened? And now they're together showing off the amazing Mode 7 zoom effects. I'm just joking. It's not really Mode 7, obviously. It's like a Super Nintendo thing. Oh, man, that one of you is loud. I remember nothing. Wait, there was a dream. It's like the beginning of Seventh Guest. I remember nothing. A man spoke to me, told me the real intro would be still ahead. Oof. Is that a joke? What is this place? Now I remember the subway. Yeah, Ryan, that would be cool if you could get on Facebook. Hey, Frank. Frank? Hello? Guess I gotta find a way up myself. So there's no speech in this game, clearly. It came on this on this CD, but there's not a lot of <laughs> it's River <of> Slime. <laughs> That's funny. There's not Ghostbusters too. All right, I find this music 
becomes very annoying. Scott says the music is jamming. All right, well, if you like it, that's fine. All right, so now I could like point and click basically, and it's like a, it's like an interface like Monkey Island. The music is getting sort of good right now. All right, so how do I do this? Sign. Sign says way blocked. It looks like it's war blocked, but okay. So I can, I can, if I move the mouse cursor around, I can see what I can interact with. Set of pulleys. So I can pick up. Set of pulleys. Hmm, I must have lost it during the accident. This is literally all I did, um, like just to try out the game, is I picked that up, and then I saw you could combine these two things, the string with the set of pulleys. Well, if you look at the string, he says something like, it's string, every good adventure game has to have string. So they definitely are trying to be funny. Um, whether they succeed or not, I don't know. So I have a string of pulleys, but I don't know what, what to do with it. And it looks like there's nothing else I could do here. Wait, what's this? To station. Can I take the sign? Can't reach it. And there's rails here. This is the part of the music I don't like. The book goes like... It makes me feel like nauseous for some reason, I don't know. I want to say about it. All rusty rails for years, they have been in use. There's another one of these games with bad, bad English translation, it looks like. Oh, let's go to station. <coughs> okay. So, where's the corpse? Supposed to be an, abandoned, an antique corpse. How's the the streaming, by the way? Is the video, the audio coming through okay, everybody? There's a brick wall. I think here was once some sort of entrance. Now it's blocked. So I push it. I <coughs> can't move it. Uh, okay. Can I do anything with it? I doubt a string of pulleys is gonna be useful for that, but how you do that? You press use, and then you... I don't know how to use this. Yeah, okay, I didn't think so, but... Is there anything else I could do with this here? Pick up the bricks? What was that? It said hook. Why not let it... Where would it say hook? Oh, there's... Wait, a lot of little pixel hunting there. That's pretty darn, uh, small. Alright, it's not get a hook. Can I attach the hook to the, uh, string of pulleys? No. Sorry for the coughing, I don't know why I was going to start coughing. Audio's perfect? Okay, good. And the video's okay too? I mean, it's probably difficult for it not to be that good. Maybe I can use the hook to, like, chop it to chip at the bricks? Hmm, I think I could. It fits quite perfectly. Okay. Now the hook is in the wall. Can I pull the hook? No, maybe I have the pulley though. String of pulleys. Yeah, come on. Pick that up. Put on the hook. Alright, there we go. That was a pretty quick animation. Stu is also known as Stu the Cruel, Stu the Torturous, Stu the Despised. <laughs> to Room. That's very descriptive. What else is here? Um, blocked entrance. I think there has been an entrance in former times, but now the past is blocked. That's not happening. All right, let's go to room. Ooh, oh, oh, there's dead man. Looks like someone broke in here. Someone shot him. Must be some sort of supervision room of the muse museum above me. Oh, whoa, interesting. On the back of this thing, this is made in Canada, by the way, um, for those Canadians here. And it says on it, violence rating, minimal violence. Crime scenes may contain blood and implied violence. Um, that's pretty implied. This guy freaking like shot in the head, it looks like. All right, let's take a look at him. Hmm, he was shot. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> uh, can I like search him or something? I won't touch him. <laughs> Those Canucks, sorry about that. Uh, displays. Let's see. Oh, cool. It's mode 7 again. 
Oh, look at that. What's... Security camera? What the hell? I think I've been just watching a crime. Why is it, like, spastically moving so fast? I wonder if, like, I gotta slow down DOSBox or something. And I even... Recognized... Recognized his face. You recognized him? Now... That means that... <laughs> what does it mean? Oh, wait, oh, here's his buddy. Frank. Hey, Frank, how's it going? What the hell's going on here, Paul? The next night, in a gloomy mansion... Okay. Finally, we got that stone plate! The inscription leads us directly to our target. That guy's holding a gun behind him. But what exactly is our target? I can't tell exactly, but know that it's the source. Look at those amazing facial graphics. Oh, that immense power! Just tell me that you believe in this twaddle. Twaddle? We shall see. Now, let's try to figure out the inscription on the plate. Looks like the yeah, Jones. Strange language, the cradle of... T -t 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 I can't make it out. It's like Monty Python. The ground is in the castle of... Arg. What about having a drink on our glorious theft first? Glorious? Have you read the newspaper? Why? What's about it? <clears throat> Witness found. They spelled witness wrong. And the, and the, how is this possible? Is that supposed to be me? We're lucky these fools wrote down his name in this article. Yeah, that is pretty stupid. Paul Cole. Yeah, that's me. Paul Cole, eh? We've got to get rid of him. <laughs> this is really stupid. He'll go to Washington, D.C. by plane tomorrow. There he's to make a statement at court. But I'll never arrive there. Ah, ha, ha. I'll see to this personally. What's that guy? Is he a guy with a mask on? A lot, of, a lot of nice cutscenes here. So I'm going on this plane, I guess? Is that me? Why did I go to Washington, D.C.? Why is the plane... Oh, it's because there's somebody else sneaking on the plane. Oh my god, he planted a bomb! To it go off in 90 minutes? 90 minutes, I guess. <laughs> Alright, now I'm going to the plane. I guess it's daytime. I mean, we need one of these zoom-ins here to see what the hell's going on. Oh, oh there's a guy smoking. Oh, it's 1948. Good morning, sir. I'm Jack Harvey, your bodyguard for this flight. Why do I have a bodyguard? Oh, I'm here to certain your arrival in Washington, D.C. or make your statement at court. Okay. I'm pleased to meet you, Mr. Harvey. Look at that guy lounging on that thing. Ah, yeah. I'll stay right beside you. I could just sit I just could sit down here. Good day, sir. Do you mind if I... Oof, he's sleeping. Wow, those nice cutscenes. What the heck? Don't move, there's players under my command now. It's being hijacked, too. Whoa! That dude just, like, what happened? He just gave up? He, he pulled a gun, he got shot? If anybody's trying to get I'll shoot him dead. Now keep that in mind, buddy, and get me some buddy of the crew. <laughs> Tell the pilot we're going on a holiday to the Philippines. What the hell's going on here? Yeah. <laughs> they don't think I'm some friends of mine. Take them back to the Iran. To the Iran. <laughs> a great map here. What the heck? Where'd we go? Look, I went to India. That's the Philippines? Well, okay, now the bomb went off. What's that? I guess he didn't know about the bomb. Ah. I think he said ah. Ah. What the, what the hell's going on? Did I jump out the window? <laughs> I guess I did. Two hours later. Wow, it takes a long time to fall in a parachute. Two hours later? What the hell? <laughs> okay. And now I landed like on top of another plane? Okay, so. Hold on a second. First, of all, I'm going to catch up on the chat here. Not much. Just I'm kind of surprised Stu's face was painted. Stu's men right now. What are you talking about, Ryan? All right, so let's get, how this game pick 9/11? <laughs> so I don't understand this because usually I pick these indie games. They try to be freaking weird and bizarre, and this time 
I got like a physical game that I own, and it also like is completely ridiculous. Like, what the heck kind of nonsense is going on here? That plot made no sense at all. Did you see that? Did you got you guys saw that, right? Is it was it just me? Like, the guy put the first they printed his picture in the paper because he's a witness, and then they planted a bomb to kill him. But then this mustache guy hijacked him to go to Philippines to pick up his buddy, and they're gonna go from there to the Iran. But the bomb went off, so he, this, this dude jumped out the window. Even though he's a construction worker, apparently? I don't know who, the, who this guy is, even. And then two hours later, he finally landed. That's a summary of what... I, I don't know. I mean, do you guys have any idea what's going on here? I have, I have a parachute. I guess I can continue the game. Planes bow, planes tail. This, what's this? Uh, nothing. It's like a, a, bleak, a bleaking light. Hey Ninja, how you doing? <laughs> yeah, I'm totally lost at the plot already. I'm pretty lost. We're too jungle, okay. So I go somewhere. Let's wait, what's the else here? So uh, Le Leanne? Is that like a vine? I thought I'm pretty good at vocabulary words, but like I can't reach it. Of course not. Okay, look at the plane's bow. It's a part it it it? What chord is that? I apostrophe T? How do you even pronounce that? Ite? A part of the plan? Thank goodness. Hey, it's our tomato. How you doing, man? Good to see you. Haven't seen you on a stream in I don't know how long. Plane's tail. It's a part of the plane. Alright, it's a part of the plane. Can I do anything with it? Probably not. No, I don't think this would be a great idea. What is it? Is this like, did it talk to it? Hey, already heard about Escape from Delirium? I guess let's talk to it. Is this drop something? I don't know what that is. Where should I move it to? I don't know. Get the hell out of my way. Can't move that. It's far too heavy. Oh, wait, this is like a German. Viel zu schwer? Does anybody know what that means? Viel zu schwer? Somebody must know what that means. Alright, I feel like I should be able to get this Leanne, but I don't see how to get it. Maybe with the parachute? No, I can't do that. What's stopping from just walking underneath this thing? And, oh, wait, now. Wait, 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 wait. Can you get it now? Are you close enough now to get it? Why are you walking back over there to say you can't reach it? Uh, whatever, I guess you can't get it. Alright, I'm gonna leave. Oh, there's a sign here. It says, attention, don't touch the telegraph wires. Like, the 10,000 volts. How do I touch them anyway? They're like million like miles of the air. Stone. There's dry wood on the stone. Okay, let's pick up the dry wood. Too heavy. I, I don't want this. I want the dry wood. Is there. Is maybe it's to light a fire here or something? But how do I save the game? Let me save the game. This is like asking for trouble if I don't do that. Stew. Did it save? Yeah, it did. Okay. Play. Bush. It means too difficult? Oh, interesting. Okay. Ryan says, Stu, on Facebook, just to add you, you're welcome. All the people you may know are people from South America. So my name is Navarro. So you know, oh, okay. Interesting. <laughs> uh, I don't know why they do that. Bush. Let's look at the bush. The bush is in my way. Push the bush. It's not that easy. Probably to light a fire or something. There's a bush here, too. I want this bush. Nothing unusual. I think he started to do something with it. But the stone has something on it. There's dry wood on the stone, but I can't actually take it? How do you do this? What's this? This, this, this doesn't do nothing? I'm not Superman. Okay. It's too low to push the bush. Yeah, <laughs> you guys both are doing the same thing there. <laughs> if I go this way, 
can't. Why does it look like there's like an alligator in my inventory? Okay, what about to tell the bow? When the bow breaks, the cradle will fall. It's a bow with two telegraph wires above it. Can I get up there? To where? To here. Yeah, that's what I was trying to do. Bow to bush. No, I can't do that. Bow. It's a weird interface here. Wait. Bow to telegraph wire. Don't know how to use this. Alright, let's look at the telegraph wire. There are two telegraph wires. You don't say. Pick up telegraph wires. What do you mean with taking these wires? I mean, take them. Like, rip them down from the sky. And when I pull the wires to where? I still don't know what this icon does. Now let's try the, uh, the parachute. That's all I have here. I don't want to do that. What's the sense of doing that? I don't know. I don't know how to use this. I don't know how to use that. But I don't want to do that. Yeah, the icons do look weird, I agree. Um, I, f I guess I can't go this way, is what it's telling me. Like, I guess, okay, there's like some bush in the foreground that's blocking me. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go back, cause I'll see if I can take the sign. Not that I want to, but... It's fixed to the tree. So, how come it says here there's a thing on the stone and I can't take it? Chomp? Start to me, what are you chomping? Yeah, try that out. I'm not Superman. It's weird, there's a dry thing. You think I can be able to do something with that? Apparently not, okay. Let's go back this way. Maybe I can do something else here that I missed. The eye of muscles, yeah. Or I don't know what that is. Some kind of veins or something? It looks like there's a string there, but I, I can't take that one. Why can't they reach that? It's, okay, okay, can I like, manipulate this thing? Well, that like picked it up. What, what does this do? So this this thing like lets you use it, right? Does this thing let, let me throw it away? Hold on a second. I gotta try this. Okay, that's like to get rid of it? No, that belongs to me, he says. Well, I don't care. I'm just trying to like do something useful here. I don't want to give away my items. Okay, so this is give, I guess. This is give. That's what this is. Right, I'm assuming that's give. It's the parachute, yes. I'm assuming this is give, but I'm just gonna try that again. Okay, it's mine. Alright, so yes, we get it. That's yours. Ninja says, hey Stu, could you explain what the actions graphic icons mean? I might have missed that. So I'm not really sure, but I think this means look. This means take, this means use, this means push or pull, this means give, this means talk, this means like, uh, open? Actually, you know what? I thought this was like quit the DOS, but maybe it's open. I would just damage it. Yeah, I guess it's open. And this is like the, the controls. So I didn't try that open until now because I didn't realize what it was. So let me try that open on these other things here. Let me try to open the bush. <laughs> open? <laughs> He's like, no, that doesn't open. I'm just want to try. Just a little experimentation here. No, you can't open any of these things. Oh, can I open the parachute? Why should I? Because I told you to, jackass. That's why you should. You, like... If I tell you to do something, you should freaking do it. Why should I? 
It's your typical Sierra style icon. It's not so typical, but it's it's close enough. All right. Okay, so I can interact with the plane's bow or bow. Bow, I think it's pronounced. And the plane's tail. And that's it. And there's also this liane, which I assume means a vine. But I don't know. I can see stuff in, like through the cockpit, but it's just a part of the plane. T is do this talk, which is used, yeah. Um, it's a part of the plane. I can't open either one, apparently. And I can't walk on top of it. I don't even know which plane this is. This is not the. Was this, is this the same plane that I was in? I guess probably. I gotta see if there's any like pixel hunting here. Maybe there's something I'm missing. It's a jungle. It's a parachute. It's a lean, obviously. Let's try this again. Why can't I take this thing? Can't reach it. And I can't use this to get it. That seemed, that, that seemed logical, though. I can't that reach it. But it's bent over. <laughs> After your 2000, the original protagonist toy themselves really grabbed my ears. I just avoid them and play Hopas. Hit an object. Uh, since they the first person that's inner thought. Yeah, I don't know what the deal is why he's talking, talking to himself. He's talking to me, I think. But this is games from 1995. It's not even 2000. So I can't reach this at all. I can't push this too damn heavy. Right? But my hands would probably get dirty? Who cares? Can't move that. But this one, you say your hands would get dirty? No. Okay, so that's just a generic response. And you can't open anything. No! No! Alright. Uh... Yeah, open. It's not like I mean, go inside. I want you to go in. Like it's not so difficult. All right. So there's a string I can't get. This is a bush blocking my way, which you'd think I'd be able to just freaking like push it over, not like kick it or something. It's not that easy. Or to walk through it. I mean, like it gets pretty far back there, but. Right, I'm about to look at, the, at some hints, unless somebody has an idea, because I'm getting annoyed. I feel like I tried just about everything. No idea what to do with these wires or whatever, but I can't reach them. Can't get up there. It also says don't touch them. This sign says don't touch the telegraph wires. I don't know why there's telegraph wires here. And this stone, like it has, it has like a, some dry, if you look at it, it says there's dry wood on it. Like, wow, there's dry wood on the stone, but I can't pick up the dry wood, apparently. I don't know how to pick up the dry wood, unless there's like a little tiny hot spot. To play in. Make sure I'm not missing something here. I don't think so. Alright, can you climb a tree? I mean, I don't know how to climb a tree. Like, there are dry wood in the stone. What does that even mean? I, I'm, I'm with you. Alright, let me try to look at the hints. I, I think I gotta get a, a sense of what is going on here. Escape from delirium. FAQ. We'll walk through King. Okay. It says enter the plane's tail section. See, this is what I mean. Like, I, I mean, wasn't I trying to do that? See, I don't like when you can't, like, you. <laughs> Wait a second. I don't like when you try to do something that doesn't work. I mean, like. Let's try. Okay, enter the plane's tail section. What am I doing wrong? To plane. Plane. What? Wait, what the hell? Wait a second. 
So just clicking on it worked? Not for the plane's bow. Come on. Give me a break. Come on. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's so stupid. Alright. That's like see that's not that's not even counting as like using a hint. That's just that's like just like BS. Alright, there's a bunch of dead people. Dead man, broken glass, metal piece. It's a loose hanging piece of metal. Let's take the metal piece. It's like a crowbar. That is crowbar. Broken glass. <laughs> the guy looks like he's having a blast. Actually, it's funny. This is the guy that was like sleeping and with his feet on the uh, the railing over here. And I guess this is the security guard. It's a storage room too. It's also my like luggage. Let's uh, look at the dead man. Lara Croft discount edition. He's forgotten to fasten his seatbelts. Yeah, no kidding. Oh, zooming in. <laughs> Pixels. <laughs> What's the point to that? <laughs> Does it seem like the blood dripping closer? Uh, can I take him? No way, I won't touch him. He refused to search dead people, I noticed. He's very squeamish. Or what about the cases? Nice cases. I'm sure there's nothing in but some old clothes. Yeah, I guess. I mean, you're not going to bother to look, but okay. Dead man. Nothing to find. If you say so. I don't trust this game anymore in terms of the interface. They're, like, cheating me a few times already. Ooh, a chicken. Those are apples? How are apples green? Gloss? Yeah, well, actually, it's Diet Coke tonight. What's, glo what's gloss? Green boxes, chicken, box. All right, let's use like a crowbar on the, bo on the box. That worked. It's open. Let's see. A rope and a machete. All right, that's good. Got them. That sounds good. All right, let's take a take a green apple. I mean, there could be green apples, but those look like look like lettuces or I don't know what they look like. Can I take the chicken? How should I put a living chicken into my pocket? I don't know. You figure it out, buddy. Can I talk to the chicken? I, are, they, are they suggesting I kill the chicken? What's the sense in doing that? I don't know. Yeah, no. <laughs> Sorry, tomato. Obviously, apples can be green, but like what I meant was they don't <laughs> they don't look like apples. I'm sorry. They were nailed shut. Can I use the crowbar on those? I don't know how to use this. Oh, you idiot. They're too heavy. What's this here? What's gloss? Does anybody know what gloss is? Oh, it's an empty glass with a rubber used to close it. Oh, it's just glass spelled wrong? Are those like, are those like a glands or something? So I got glass? I guess it's like a cup. With a rubber used to close it? If you say so. All of a sudden I got tons of inventory items. And there's also a chicken. <laughs> I guess that would be to kill the chicken. They kind of look like apples from the store. What store do you go to, Sardomato? That like the apples from the store I go to. Alright, well let me open this apparently. Let me back with the machete. Let's try the machete. No. Alright, forget that. Let's leave. Hopefully the machete... Like I said, the chicken's probably not for anything important. Here, clearly Brussels sprouts kill them. I like Brussels sprouts. Uh, when I was a kid, I didn't like them, but my wife makes them. They're pretty good. Alright, now... She's a machete. There you go, you whack that bush. Chop it up. Finished. Took you long enough. Can I use the rope? There's a string. Wait a second, I forgot about the other thing. Let me go back to the other, other screen. 
I want to see if I can pick up that, uh, that Liane now. Take the machete. Did this make sense? I mean, I did. I guess you don't think it makes sense. I don't know how to use this. Hey, wait a second. I wonder if I can put the chicken in the glass. I just want to try that quickly. <laughs> no, of course they sell green apples. I mean, they're called Granny Smith, but they just don't look like apples. They look like crab apples, maybe. It looks like corn. It looks like a corn... Like, like a, a yellow corn with a green thing on it. Oh, what did I do? Oh, now I have two things. Rubber and glass. I didn't mean to do that. I don't want to do that. Okay, alright, whatever, that's fine. I have a rubber band. I have a rubber band and a glass. Alright, can you take this stringy thing? Wait. String. We combine the machete. Come on. Combine the machete with the string. I do think that makes sense. You first to do it? Alright, fine. Alright, um... I still won't get this thing, eh? I can't reach it. I mean, it shouldn't be so hard to reach it. You have all these different items that you can reach it with. Alright, I'm just gonna forget about it for now. Um, should I try to... This is a string, right? I tried this already. String on the telegraph wire. The hell if we're all fixated on what the food is. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Oh, 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 he's gonna do something. He's doing something. That was cool. It was sort of cool. Alright, let me save the game. Let's go stew two. Alright, so now what? Could you, like, go up that thing? Uh... Oh, come on. Can I pick up the telegraph wires? What do I mean? I, I don't mean anything. I mean, like... What's, what does it do now? I can't even, like, interact with this rope anymore. It's, like, not even there. I don't want to do that. Uh, cause I, I hung a rope here, but I can't... Hey, Colton Northern, how you doing? I didn't see you even join. What's going on with this? Well, I'm not completely stuck. I, I mean, I can't even summarize the plot <laughs> that happened until now, but the most interesting thing is I was on a plane then someone put a bomb on it to kill me, and then the plane was hijacked by somebody who, fl who flew to the Philippines to pick up his buddy, and then to go to Iran, and then the bomb blew up in the Philippines, and we cr but I jumped out before that, and parachuted down for two hours, and then eventually landed in this jungle, and the plane got down before I did, and, uh, I don't know, Ryan, apparently he's supposed to look like, I, th the, 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 I think they borrowed part of the sprite from, like, Guybrush from Monkey Island too, because he were really looking sort of short like this, little goatee. I just um put this like rope here, and I don't know <coughs> why I did that. Let me keep going because I was able to cut this path. So let's. What's this? What the hell is that? Oh, that's a snake. It looks like a gopher, like a gopher with like a long tail. <laughs> Go to the right so that clears it up. <laughs> The game makes no sense. Oh, let's put it that way. A stone. The stone doesn't look very stable. Okay, can I push it? It's much too heavy. There's like a trash can here. Rubbish. It's rubbish. Some bottles, some cans. Nothing useful. What the hell is it doing here? What is this, quicksand? A oh, heavy stone. It's a big rock. Okay, and a sign. Horty ahead. It's a cobra with a head on its head. What's 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 a horty? This is two 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 rock. Okay. 
But there's a path here too. What's the deal with this? What kind of snake? Nice snake. Is it the machete on the snake? Is the sense of doing that? Well, it's like a dangerous snake, so I mean that's sort of sensical. I'll just kill all the bugs that are underneath it. Do I care? What's going on here? I don't know what, the, what I'm even doing. All right. Um, <laughs> Ryan, you're right. They crashed to the trash can and signage. Yeah, hey, what the hell? I don't understand this. What's this here? Footsteps? I think they'd be like rungs of a ladder. Wall. What's going on here? The wall's covered with thorn bushes. What, what, what am I trying to do here now? What's the sense to do that? So I don't like cut my hands. That's the sense. Look at the shadow. And, like, how come I'm like, I'm, I'm like casting a shadow with my feet where there's like no sun or anything? Where's the light source that's casting that shadow? Alright, what's this here? A bird. Nice birdie. I can't pick this. I want to pick it up. I just looked at it, didn't I? Oh, why not let it in its place? Can I pick up the bird? It would probably peck at me. The bird would just peck off my hand. This guy's really a uh, brave soul. I mean, I don't believe it. Why is he picking up a bird anyway? No, I can't do that. All right. I have something nothing else I could do here. Yet. It just, I was just about to comment on the shadow. Yeah, it's like not noticeable here because it's so dark, but on that screen it was really noticeable. Give it to Snake. What the Oh, there was a there was a worm? I didn't see a worm. Let me go back. I mean, this is a bird. It's not I don't think it's a worm. And you can't pick it up. So I assume that's what you meant. Let's see what this is over here. That snake is like really ridiculous. What the hell is this? This is, oh you're joking. There's a pentagram. It's a signpost. Looks like a pent. Oh, that's a compass. And there was a pentagram. It looks like a pentagram. And there's a billboard from movie theater. Bow. It once was part of a tree. Can I take this one? Yes. Okay. That's like a slingshot or something. Okay, can I get a rock for that? Pierce Brosnan? Escape from Delirium, see it. Oh, it looks a little bit like Pierce Brosnan, I see what you're saying. I think it's supposed to be Arnold. No, I have no idea what it's supposed to be. Uh, signpost. There's a wind rose, you mean a compass rose carved into the ground. This is north is that way. Oh gosh, this is like a freaking maze. Look at this. This path here, path here, path here, path here. So you get a path, you get a path. Oh my gosh. Why not let it in its place? I don't want to see if there's any puzzle there, that's why. Or should I move it to? I don't know. Let's go this way. Oh my gosh. No, I don't want to get lost. Okay. I don't have a map that shows me where to go. I would just get lost. Is there supposed to be a map somewhere? I don't want to get lost in the jungle. I was thinking John Wick. No, I just get lost. But you have a signpost. Does that do anything for you? Can I like uh, carve it out of the pick it out of the ground? I take it. Other people would perhaps get lost without this signpost. <laughs> That's real brilliant uh, thinking there. All right, let's go back. I'm not sure. I'm sort of happy actually it didn't let me do that. All right, so we sold this rubbish. This is nothing there. I can't do that. So okay, what are, what are we what are we doing here? There's a snake that dances like a fool. Can I talk to the snake? Sorry, what time is it? 
Okay. Uh, I have a heavy stone here. It's a big rock, he says. I don't know why I care. Unless the idea is to make this snake, like, fall off and kill himself, but... If I had a, it'd be nice if I had a, uh, a stone to, to use for this... Oh, wait a second, hold on. Let's use the sticky rubber on the bow. There we go. Now I can shoot stones with those. If only a stone shooter. I promise I don't have a stone. No, I can't do that. Oh, here's, here's a heavy stone. That's probably too heavy. Here's a stone. I <laughs> doubt that this is going to work. To rock. Let's use a stone like this. Maybe like break it into lots of small stones. Alright, let's go back here. Foots. There was no like, uh. Like if I try to do this on this guy, I'm sure it's not gonna work. Yeah, I don't have stones to shoot with. So I need to find some stones. Hmm. I don't want to carry this with me. Well, I just, just want a couple. Where should I move it to? I don't move it to anywhere, it's just like, uh... No, I can't do that. I just want to get a couple of rocks or something. Those weren't they some footsteps? So what's the sense of doing that? I mean, nothing if you know everything what to do. Put the bird in the slingshot? I don't think that's going to work, but I'll, I'll try it. No, no stones to shoot with. Put the snake in the jar. The snake is so derpy. <laughs> open the bird. <laughs> Fine, I'll open the bird. <laughs> you should learn to play adventure games, Star Tomato. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Uh, no. Let's go back. I gotta find some uh, some rocks. Apparently there's none in the rubbish. What did it say about this stone? Remember that game when I killed the bird? That was like the adventure game jailbreak game, wasn't it? Oh, wait, wait, what's this? Root. Okay, it's another, it's another hot spot here. Nice roots. Can I take a root? Nice piece of wood. Aha, I got a piece of... I got a stick. Okay. That's why you gotta do stuff like this to make sure you didn't miss anything. These cheapo games. Because there might be something else that you missed. Let's try to use the stick on the snake. I don't know how to use this. Oh, can you move the rock? That's a good question. Make move the rock with the crowbar. Aha! Or break it. Little st lit lit stones, ninja. That was a good call. Now I got some lit stones. Now I can take the broken stone and put it in my stone shooter. Okay, but where's the target? It's on the next screen over here. Stone shooter, bird. <laughs> Look at that bird. Oh, you missed. Oh you, oh, you hit him. I think he's dead. Bird. I want to keep my hands. Okay, he's just happy that he knocked him off. Can I go up here now? Hey, there's a village to the north. Oh, so now I can see which way I'm going. Okay, I get it now. Alright, oh, that's fine. <clears throat> Eat the bird? I don't think you can. I think this is talking. I don't think it's eating. <laughs> it's funny, though. Uh, yeah. I should, like, cut the bird up, you know, with this uh, machete, but it doesn't work. I don't know how to use this. How about I hit the bird with a stick? Maybe I can put the bird in the jar. The empty glass. Yeah, I did think it makes sense, but if you don't, that's okay. All right, that's fine. Let's let's keep going. At least we figured out. I think now I can probably go north here. There we go. 
What the? Village? Amusement park? Supermarket? Signpost? Oh, this is like Monkey Island, isn't it? Stip the snake with a stone? Oh, I could try that if you want. Signpost? Village? Supermarket? This is really weird. What the hell's the supermarket doing over here? Let's go back. Let's try to hit the snake with a stone for, for Colton Northern. Or <laughs> the supermarket in the jungle has Instacart. <laughs> oh, man. Hold on. Stone shooter and <laughs> snake. No, I won't let me do that. Maybe they can deliver to my timeshare. <laughs> Only when it's Cedric. Cedric is an owl. Oh, okay. That's a bird, I guess. Ugh, I'm stupid. I'm stupid today. A signpost. Oh, it's the same place, sorry. There's a second burb. Shoot a burb into a burb? What are you talking about? It's welcome. Welcome. Fortune. Well, souvenirs. <coughs> Slot machine? What kind of weird place is this? Unless it's going into deer, I guess. Right, two houses. The jungle. Oh my goodness. This is a pretty big village. D. The monster? Oh, there's a freaking dead guy. What? Arch enemy? What's going on here? Let me save the game. What the hell is going on here? Is it oh, the, the pentagram screen is a red woodpecker. Okay, I didn't realize that. Does anybody know what's going on? Inspector? Lit Flint's pneumatic drill. <laughs> what the hell is going on here? I, I don't know. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Showcase. It's like a showcase showdown. There's a pneumatic drill inside. Sure. This looks normal. <laughs> I can destroy everything with it. Let's take it. I can't take it. Can I use the, gla the glass? piece of glass on the glass. I don't want to do that. Why not? How about smash it with the machete? With the crowbar? No, I can't do that. Alright, let's look at... What about the inspector? It is called delirium, it's true. Good point. It's called escape from delirium. What did it say about him? I'll just read the chat. It looks like some sort of inspector. <laughs> looks like some sort of inspector. Oh, wow, there's a dialogue thing here. Who are you? What are you doing here? Hello, uh, hello. Hello, hi. Who are you? I'm C. Nita, the inspector. What are you doing here? Officially, I'm here to guard these vitrines. What's a vitrine? Is that like a latrine? An inofficial? Inofficially? <laughs> I'm a secret agent. I'm trying to find out who that person in the white coat is. He has no business to be here. Like, you just tell everybody you're a secret agent, eh? Maybe he's a doctor. A doctor never. I got out that he gets unconscious when he spells blood. Okay. Buy any service? Serve us? What's serve us? No clothes allowed here. What? <laughs> They're all wearing clothes. Notices. Cheap used diapers for sale. Soundtrack of Metal Eye Joe. Right to Universe of Music Limited. Eat what? China? They're already flat war forms hanging beside. And there are already stamps on them. I'll take one of them. Alright, I just want to take a pause for a second just to remind everybody. I purposely try not to pick an indie adventure game and pick a game that I actually have a physical copy of. And apparently it was a not a good strategy <laughs> because we still got some incomprehensible thing. D monster. I think I know from so oh it's Doom. It's Doom Monster, that's what they're saying. D dash dash M. It's like the uh what Sar Tomato already said, well, it's a Doom Imp. Ripped from an end screen of Doom. Yeah, I look at the Doom Imp. Okay, I, I wasn't 
I th I, mean, I wasn't really paying attention before. Why does it have a scarf around it? I mean, what's it doing there? Can I take the Doom Monster? I don't like it. Push the Doom Monster? No, I don't move things that don't belong to me. That's just true. At least that contradiction. Copy. I mean, it's... Okay, so... Arch enemy. A nearly dead boy. I call him Little Gates. What? Hi, hi. I am Bond, James Bond. And who are you? <clears throat> I guess he's not. He's not responding. Hello, please speak to me. And this guy, even though he's walking back and forth, I can't interact with him. So this whole screen is basically. I got this order form. What about the Flintstone? Flintstones, beat the Flintstones. We're the modern Stone Age fam. Yabba dabba. Okay, good. Got my joke too. I got a Flintstone. Oh, now I can like light that uh, that thing with its other rock, maybe. Maybe. That's my guess. But I don't understand why this is arch enemy for this dude here. Like it. And what is this? Like I think of salt. All right, this goes to village. What is this thing? I don't know what's going on here. All right, uh, to village. What oh, other screen? Oh, to house. How many screens are there here? Scaffolding. Door. Library. Another door. It's a scaffolding. You spelled it right the first time. Can't you spell it right the second time too? It's a closed door. All right, open the door. It seems to be locked. So of course. Why is there like a pose cut out of it? What about this one? It's a closed door. Maybe this one will be open. Ah, there we go. Okay. Darkness. It's darkness. Can you do anything with darkness? Close the door. I don't want to go out the door. I want you to close the door. Let me have the back of the door be something. Look at this other here, but I can't interact with it. There was a puzzle in one of the Monkey Island games where it was, I think, where it was dark, and the longer you stayed in the room, the lighter it got. But that was like a room that you were forced to go into. And you had no choice. I don't really see anything here, unless it's pixel hunting that I'm missing. I guess I need a lamp or something, which I don't have. Actually, there was a lamp in the first screen. There was a lamp in the first screen. I remember, I, I just didn't pick it up. The first village screen, there was a lamp. I'll go back and get it afterwards. Wires. It's a ripped wire. This looks dangerous. I'm going to carry this with me. Uh, I wonder what that does. Do I have anything to fix that? Right at the moment. Let's try to go in here. Ooh, it's a whole store of some kind. Rosary Maker. There's a lot of stuff here. This is a pretty big game, I will tell you that much. So, rosaries. I guess the Rosary Maker makes rosaries. The small man with a fireman's helmet. Hi. Welcome, are you interested in some Hank's handmade rosaries? Uh, what are you doing here? Just touch the wire. If I knew I had to touch the wire, Jasper would have done it. I, I'm making rosaries. What is this overall for? Well, making rosaries is only a hobby of mine. My profession is fireman. I like being a fireman. It's such a, it sounds like, it sounds like a five-year-old. I know the whole city here, but I call it a town. Ha, ha, ha. Why, the genius? I mean, look around here, but don't touch anything. Bye. 
He arrives as a Catholic, apparently. Cord? Can I take a rosary? Cord flakes? Oh, he said don't touch anything. I don't need all of them, right? Do you, do you need one of them, maybe? Cord flakes. They look like I better won't tell you. I mean, that's what that means that they're not taken. Yeah, okay. Hose. I can always use some hose. That's a hose. Yeah, it is. Perhaps later. Calendar. What's that bird flying around? Well, the birds on top of this thing looks like the Ku Klux Klan. Colored bowl. The glassy bowl contains blue liquid. Get your hands off that. Okay. I can say don't touch. What about this cord? Oh, what's this? It's a cord in nylon. Can I take that? Can't take it while he's working. So I'm gonna start a fire basically somewhere probably. Which I mean those vector wires outside seem like a really good uh, candidate for starting a fire. Catholic firemen selling rosaries to a jungle well nowhere. <laughs> Ryan says, why is this one arm going <laughs> I'm just, that, was, that was funny, but Ninja's saying, oh, gross, is even funnier. That was, that, that was, that was what sold that one. Alright, um, <laughs> Ryan, we got it the first time, we'd have to say it again. U9? Bypass sign? Internet? Rock with hose. What the hell is going on in this place? It's just cook backwards. It's a rock with a hose coming right out of its middle. The cyborg is internet. I think it's a telephone. Am I supposed to connect the, the hose to the hose? Can I do that? Perhaps later. Okay. He's definitely Catholic. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Any other Catholics here may take uh, offense to that, though. Or exception to it. The door. Bypass sign. U9. It was like the ultimate nine. I wonder why they put a bypass sign here. Me too. Alright, at least I can't... There's finally nowhere to go anymore. It's like, gosh. So can I open this stupid door? Oh, but I need to talk to it. Open the door. No, open the door. Here we go. What's this guy doing? <laughs> Ryan says, I'm assuming you're the only Catholic here. I, I would not make such assumptions. You never know. It's, you know, ca Catholicism is not the, is like not the, the, the smallest religion ever, you know. Uh, okay, a cook. A, a pot. Some sort of stew, but it smells like rotten fish. It's some kind of me. Quilted Northern's also a Catholic. See, Ryan, I told you there's be some other one there. Let's talk to the cook. Hi. Hello, I hope you've come to have a great meal. Who are you? I'm the most famous cook in this area. You must be the only cook around here. No, but if I cooked better, I wouldn't be. What? The most famous cook around here? Oh. Are you so well known for your bad food? This guy's so polite. Yes, of course. It's the only way for me to become famous. May I have a taste, please? What are you, like... Yes, of course, but you gotta pay, so just give me something nice. I don't have anything nice right now. This stew smells terrible. I know. Why don't you use these finished soups? Who said I want to make good meals? Oh, sorry. That's okay. Bye. What was the point of that? But I guess I can't do anything with this until the time comes. 
come back here. It's like nice to give this person internet rock with hose. It's amazing how I was stuck in that one little screen and all of a sudden this like opened up. It's like the biggest freaking thing in the world. And this is a hose coming out of it too. So it's locked, but I, I didn't remember these. What was inside here? Library? I don't remember, I, I'm going because I don't remember what was in here anymore. Oh, the dark place. Okay. Let's go back to houses. Well, crazy game. Oh, what just happened? Get, get out there. Alright, so there was a lamp here, remember? So, so I can take it. I don't want to carry this with me. Darn it. Why the hell not? Alright, let's see what I can do here. Lamp. It lights up this place. Well. Get the lamp to light it with the flint that into the library. Hey, it's really very deep. I may can just make a torch or something. So I wanna try I wanna go back and try that quickly. And there's your bird that you're talking about, but I don't, I can't interact with the birdie. Where is that? Uh, this way. Use this flint stone on the stone. There we go. Now it gets a burning stick. It's a fire, and I still don't know what to do with that, by the way. But, alright, this way. I got a torch. Oh, so far, the only hint I use is to, is to like, know that you can... <laughs> how to use the interface. <laughs> so, so far, so good. Cutscene, same cutscene again. I'm gonna go this way. I don't know how long that burning thing is gonna last. If you leave that fire, you'll leave the fire fire later. Yeah, true. What? Cold wind blow extinguish my fire. Alright. I'm not going to do that again right away. That wasn't that was not very amusing. I was gonna put the put the glass on top of it? Would that actually work? I wonder if it, if you put a glass on top of a flame it would put it out, right? I mean it would, that wouldn't work. Let's go into the house here. Oh, that's nice. It's like, is that Guybrush's head on the th th flusher? I think you mean the plunger. It's a flusher. No, it isn't. It's a plunger. It's definitely a plunger. Alright, I got a plunger. A fortune teller. Looks like a head of a fortune teller. That's pretty weird. Why can't I only see your head? A good question. Hello, who are you? Jojo, Mojo's sister. I'm the last representative of an old religion. This sounds like uh, Mikey Island. You're only a cheap tourist attraction. Tell me more about this religion. The point of it was that we didn't know what exactly we were worshipping. We did it, snow. That sounds confusing. Yes, of course. That was the only way to obtain real believers because... Steal the head, maybe. The others that weren't really interested in this religion didn't plain start to join it. Aha, you sure had followers then? Well, yes, once they had lots of followers. 
They were called, they were very powerful and called the Guardians of Sanctification. Sanctification. It's hard to read this. Now that's enough. I'm not supposed to tell these things around. So why are you just telling some random person? Groovy, hey, where am I? <laughs> Scientology. This is so, this is a very mighty place, so be more respectful. Are these ghosts here your relatives? No, they're just plastic models. Bye. Bye. Let's see if I can take her. Come in here and do it yourself. How about can I smash her head in? Or how about I use a plunger on her? No. Where's the other stuff I had? Here we go. Like, use... Use the machete on her. The producers of this game don't allow me to kill people. All right, well, at least I got to... I just may torture them. All right, at least I got an interesting response. All right, so cut her, cut her face with this glass. We can torture them. All right, well, let me do that. I got a lot of weapons for a game that's not violent. All right, let's just leave. I got a plunger. Still got that supermarket, by the way. Well, what about this well? Yeah, it's really very, it is really very deep. Can I do something with it? How do I interact with the well? I turn the crank, can't move it. Box tap. It's a little box with a water tap. There's a little pump inside. Okay. Can I? I don't know if this would be a great idea. What if I put this? No, oh, sorry. Use use the glass with the box tap. Can't do that. I don't want to carry. I don't want to carry it with you either. I wanted to like use it. Yeah, I do think that makes sense, actually. I think it makes a lot of sense. But obviously, you're a moron. You don't see what I'm trying to do here. Alright, uh, what else? Souvenirs? A barrel? This barrel is empty. Can I take the barrel? Sure not. It's just a big barrel. Go down Niagara Falls in it. I think I could croin can't move it. What was that? You thought you could move it and you can't? Wait, where did... What the hell's Croyd? Drain? What's going on here? What's a Croyd? I guess Croyd is some strength straining to do it. It's a drain. Echo. Okay. So the barrel is blocking the stupid ear store. I don't know what's going on here. Mailbox. It's a mailbox. Did I open the mailbox? I would just damage it. Uh, I was I wasn't trying to do that. I was trying to open the mailbox. Oh, wait, I have this form to mail, right? I don't know what the point of it is, but I, I do this order form to mail. I wonder how long this will take. Probably not very long, yeah. Crowbar the barrel. I'll try that, Ninja. What is this, though? Uh, a script? The text and music for Metal Eye Joe. Oh, that's right, that's what they wanted, right? Well, who the hell wants that? What's Metal Eye Joe? I've heard Cotton Eye Joe. Hey, J Rock, how you doing, man? Metal Eye Joe. Where do you come from? Where do you go? Where do you come from, Metal Eye Joe? Metal Eye Joe. I even forgot that I had a, a, a crowbar. I thought I had this parachute too, for that matter. Alright, what about this slot machine? The slot machine with chewing gums inside. Seems like you don't have to put some coins into it. So then, 
Let me take some chewing gums. I press this button and then... Ah, uh, here it is. Where I got some chewing gum. I have a flusher. Okay. Got lots of stuff. Got a stick. Okay, let's go... Can I go to the, to the supermarket place? Let's see what else I can do here. Yeah, you can go there. Horfi? Horfi? Horti? Horti? That's a supermarket? Horti? It's pretty empty. To service? What's a service? Why am I dropping frames all of a sudden? Is this is the uh, stream okay? Does anybody see any issues? I mean, it's, nothing's even moving, but except for me, I guess. I said I dropped some frames. I don't know why. Double pack of shirts for only seventy-nine pieces of nine. It's like a, a joke from Monkey Island, I guess. Door. Gutter. What the hell is this? Don't let me interact with it. It lagged for a second? Okay, thank you for telling me. Uh, if it does it again, I'll do something drastic. It's open, okay. What about the gutter? It's a gutter. Can I pick up the gutter? I don't like it. Now let's go inside the, the suit work. So weird. Is it working now? It's just a froze for a second, but is it working now, everybody? Hill. Dummy, okay. It's like a department store, not a supermarket. It's just not closed in a supermarket. Yeah, it's working okay. Alright. I think I lost a lot of people. Uh, game. What did I jump? <laughs> yeah, I was. Game, game. Hair dryer. Ice machine, exit, poster, I, I don't know what's going on here, look at everything, poster, escape from delirium, see it, they keep advertising their own game, I'm already playing your stupid game, you don't have to keep advertising it, it's just a dummy, you're a dummy, it's much too big, aggressive surveillance yeah you're right these cameras are really moving pretty aggressively why is there like food on the floor here some bottles maybe some plastic bottles it's like it's like a scrape of delirium of the game again it's the game you're just playing yeah of course these guys that can't get enough you've already got it if I didn't get it I have to get it again it's a really good game but again the same copy of the thing if they can afford this, okay. Let's be like Call of Duty. Something? Some something. What's something? I don't know what this is. Okay. Ice machine. Mixer. Was there a hair dryer? Hair dryer. Can I take any of this stuff? Ice machine. I don't need an ice machine. Hair dryer. Oh, you took a hair dryer with a plaque on it that says "very hot." It's also the barcode on it. Seventy-five pieces of nine. I got no money. I probably have to come back here and actually can afford afford the hair dryer. Unless the guy lets me buy stuff on credit, which I doubt. By the way, guys, hit like if you like this stream, and subscribe if you're not already subscribed. I command you to subscribe. I, the devil, command you. Do my bidding. I can pay there. Can I talk to this guy? Hey, are we, ugh. I can't pay. Can I just walk out the door without paying? Probably I'll get caught and I'll lose the game or something. Ugh, first put the hair dryer back. So annoying. Alright, um, let's 
go to Sir Miss, whatever that is. It's like a, sir, it's like a Sir Kiss, Sir Miss, Sir Kiss. But, rotated person? I guess he's dead. I thought he was barfing on the floor. But I guess he's being stabbed and he's like dripping something. Where am I? There's a prisoner too? Panic? What the hell is this? Ticket office? What in the world? There's a really beautiful native girl inside. Okay. Hello? Hi. Um, Ma. How can I persuade you to let me in? I don't know, just try. Please? Nope. Please? That's not it. Please? That's not it. This is your last chance. That's better, but... I told you you're pretty? In that case, I think you have a chance. Go on. Oh, good lord. Oh my god. Uh, nice teeth? Yes, indeed. That's what I wanted to hear you may go in. Wow. I'm a really smooth operator, apparently. Alright, what's with this prisoner? Nice plastic mod. Oh, it's like a haunted house. I see. So these are not really dead people. I think you did a lot of turning. Oh, now you're turning? What does it mean, rotated person? I don't even know what that is. There's all these dead people and you can't, like, do anything with any of them. It crashed. I hope there were some stupid inmates inside. Har, har, har. Blocking? Not like, you mean, like, the, this way is blocked. Okay, let me save one more time. I think I'm like almost done for today. Not quite, but I'm getting there. Just because. <laughs> That's all? Um, if anybody is, God forbid, like, epilepsy or something, like, please don't watch anymore. I mean, like, I think I'm actually supposed to play the game like this. Claws. To Sermies. To next room. Oh my god. I got oppressive feelings. And there's a head, too. It really looks like stone, but it's only plastic. Good lord. <laughs> J-Rock says this is not good on shrooms. Oh my god. Claws? Where's cl cl claws? I'm not going to touch them. Alright, get your ass out of here. Wait, there's also a web. Oh my god, get out of this room, please. What the hell is this? A bucket? What is this? Spikes? Bucket. It's a bucket full of frozen carbon dioxide? How's that gonna stay frozen? Dry ice, you mean? Alright, whatever. What does it say here? I don't know what's going on. Thin metal pipe? It said thin metal. Quilt the Northern gotta go? Alright, good night, Quilt the Northern. Uh, I'm probably wrapping up relatively soon, but... Um, thin metal pole. Can I take that? Hold on. Thin metal... It's fixed to the ceiling with a hook. Good lord. I don't even know what the hell I have anymore here. I'm assuming I can't take that down. Right, I'm just gonna go to the next room. I... Oh, thank God, the blinking stopped. But the screaming is still going on. Admiral T. Dagger. What's 
put on here? To room. This is really weird. <laughs> right, you stop that. This is the leader of the Imperial remains of the full of Emperor Palpatine? The statement is not important. Can I take the dagger? The sharp thin dagger. I got it. Alright, I took the dagger. I'm getting a lot of good inventory objects. Wow. Wow. I got a bucket now. Maybe I could like put water in the bucket? I was gonna try that before I to parking please. Oh my god. What are you guys saying here? <laughs> Why is the screen flashing faster now? It creates those clouds around the spikes. Yeah, there's the dry ice. Um Jelly Resident Evil 7. Oh, oh no, a whole house of plastic bag gives me the land rise <laughs> bloody talking bodies. That's a good point. Still a better Emperor Palpatine story than the last Star Wars. Let's see if I can uh, use this bucket on this tap. Do I want to do that? Why the hell not? What's the sense of doing that? There's plenty of sense of doing it. Can I open the tap? Can't open it with my hands. Uh, okay. Do I have anything that I can open it with? Maybe like a wrench or something. I don't think I have the right item to open it yet. Wait, did you see it was half day, half night the previous screen? Was it? <laughs> You're right. <laughs> It's a good point, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> I guess it's like, uh... We need to the around the international date line. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Uh... I guess... <laughs> I don't know. Alright, you know what? I think this is a good place to stop. It's been an hour and a half. It's, uh... It's sort of late over here on the East Coast. And, uh... This is, this is good. I mean, we went to a lot of locations and we picked up a lot of crap. So, like, now we'll start actually solving some puzzles with that stuff that we picked up. Oh, you can't save here? All right, well, I'll do something okay, else. I'll save in the other place. Here, can I save here? Save. <laughs> yeah, Gamer's Grotto, it's a good thing. Ryan's a stick of fork in this. Does that mean you don't like this game, Ryan? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna call a stop for tonight, and uh, we'll do something else later in the week. But I, I'm gonna continue this. But guys, if you're watching this after the fact, leave a comment. Let me know what you think what you think of this game. If you're watching it now or later, hit the like thing, and uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed. But let me know what you guys think of this. Thanks everybody for being here. Ninja Ryan, Sorry Tomato Man, good to see you. J Rock, Quilted Northern. Scott was here, I think, for a few minutes. And then he went, he ate something, and then disappeared, or, or something like that. But uh, yeah, Jeremy, obviously, I mentioned your name. Who else was here? Oh yeah, that that gentleman who who uh, joined in the beginning, Jasper. That's right. I don't know if you're still here, Jasper. But anyway, yeah, subscribe if you're not subscribed, and we'll do this again really soon. Something else different, probably. I'll probably do something. Uh, another non-adventure game like later in the week and then i'll continue this on the weekend enjoy guys have a great night peace out and speak to you later thanks guys bye bye